Hello everyone, I'm going to talk about import multiple hosts in Zabbix server and its dependencies. I've heard somebody call this topic multiple hosts, another one says mass hosts and someone else says bulky host insertion. Anyhow, the correct name is import multiple hosts. However, maybe all of them has the same meaning. We are going to insert lots of hosts to a group and use template. So we will talk about mass insertion. This part has four categories. One, host group creation. Two, import hosts. Three, template for new host group. Four, assign new host to new template. For first one, we need to do the following steps. Sometimes we create host groups to assign some triggers or other properties to same members because assigning properties one by one for each host is really difficult. It can be horrible indeed. So this part is most important part when we are faced with lots of hosts such as servers, clients and other devices such as routers, switches and maybe modems and etc. We need to have group hosts. So let us start. We should go host group in the configuration categories. Here and select host group. Then select create host group button. We should give a name for our group. So I select London uh, because my host here related to the private network in London. Then I type London here. After that, we press add button. Awesome. We create London group successfully. Well done. After creating host group, we want to insert hosts. We have to go here. In this page, we have two options, create host and import. So we are going to import multiple hosts actually. So instead of create house, we select import. Here, you are able to choose file. My file name is London and file should have a specific format XML. So London XML is my target file. So after this, leave this default option here. Just press on import. If everything is okay, we have to, yeah, create successfully. Awesome. Imported successfully. So let's go and check it. Yeah, correct. In group house London, we have 547 house here. We can see and check all hosts here. Yeah. Awesome. Now we need a template for our host group to add them inside because sometimes we need to set rule and action for them. So we need a template for these hosts. Go to the second part of configuration in the main menu in the Zabbix server, select template and then select create template. Yeah. So London is selected. You can go from this path. Actually, it doesn't matter. It's the same. So person create template. You have to give a name for your template it's better idea 
to have a related name to your house group. I create the London house. I give something like that to my template name. Group is selected and you can give some description uh, for your template name and then push an add button. Awesome. Template added. You can see here London House created but there's no any item and triggers. After finishing three previous steps we need to add the new house to our current template. We can do it via these steps. First go house group in configuration menu and select house from London group. It take you to another page that you can see host there. Select this one and you can see your host here. So select all of them in the first page and go to the bottom of this page and push on the mess update. In this page from the menu select templates and click on the original here select select the London house group if there's a no any house group here you can select from this menu and then click or tick on London host okay after all you push on the update and as you can see your host added to your template you have to do it for all hosts in your pages here great and you select one by one and do it for all pages Right here, right now, we did it. The import multiple host task is terminated. In two next video, I'm going to explain how we can create an XML file from a text file to insert multiple hosts. I know XML file creation is a prerequisite for this task, but for some reasons, I prefer to talk about this one first that I will explain about this matter later. And in the third video, I will show you how to fix some issues uh, that may happen in creating XML files. You can get this script for doing this task from my website, arponix.com. Mention the script does all these steps for you. Import export from text file to XML file and also repair your file and resolve any issue when you will get some of them thank you for your watching and i hope see you in the next video